Hey guys, Heavy here, Brand Main. Right, no one on my team or their team banned Katarina, which means boom, Brand vs. Cat. What could possibly go wrong? Right, we've got a fresh. Want the invade? I like to. Come on, fresh. This way. Okay, maybe no invade then. Right, I'm gonna get my E first. Strong against Cat. Every time she comes in the last hit of minion, I can just drop an E on her. Easy. What are we doing? Go, go, go! Hook! Hook! Ah, oh, mate! Never mind. Olaf Ghost. That's good. He doesn't even have flash as well, obviously. That would have been a, such an easy kill. <laughs> Never mind. Right. Right, so against Cat, she has to come into auto attack minions. So every time she does that, drop your E straight on her. Um, next, you get Q. You know, W is your main damage because if she hits level 2, she can jump on you quite easily and then she can do it heck of a lot of damage so this removes that option if she jumps on you you can stun her and just walk away so that's the order and then W and then just max W so you your job is to make it as difficult as possible for her to farm so as soon as she comes in for a minion or anything she's gonna come in I'm gonna try and drop any on her she probably throw her bouncing blades on me and don't stand near them Oh, I missed that one. There we go. Easy. I don't want to waste too many auto attacks on her because then the minions auto attack me and then I end up losing the trade. Just look at this pressure. Oh, wow. I didn't think I was in range for that. See, she hits level 2, she, she, she can really punish you. That's why you need your stun up. Oh, come on. Oh, I lost a bit of farm there. That wasn't good. Still one hit of her. She is roaming. Oh, no, she's back. Oh, I've got all three skills now. See what we can do. As she comes in for this big one. Don't go near it, she jumped to it. Stay away from her blades. You've got to try and catch her the moment she lands before she can jump again. Oh, good. Oh, I would just catch it then, like, just that range. How's she doing? She's doing well on farm. I'm just trying to catch her. This get lane's going to be all about who gets the first kill. She is great at dodging now. She's doing a good job. Right, what can we do? We've got no more pots now. Now we really have to catch her. But if we catch her this time, we can kill her. So... There we go. I'm not sure what happened there. Her mistake. <laughs> but it happened, so that's good. I've still got Ignite, which I'm happy about. Which means we can... Kill her again. Right, um, I want to push this lane into tower. I know I haven't got a lot of health, but it needs to get done. There it is. No. See, I took a risk there and it didn't pay off. You want to push your lane as soon as you die. As soon as you kill get a kill, sorry. But I didn't know where I left. Was I could have maybe run up. 
It was a risk. Didn't pay off. I've gone straight for a blasting one because I don't know. This is not good. No, that's gonna be cat with a kill. I've gone blasting one because I don't want. I want to be able to kill her. It's one of those lanes where it either goes really well or really badly. So. She bought. She's gonna dark seal as well. Oh, don't stand too close to that blade. Where's that enough? Well, I've got six now. She will punish me if I miss a Q. She can kill me. It's that simple. As soon as she hits six. I'm gonna let I was trying to bait her into that then. Just trying to stand. It's worth taking a little bit of damage, especially because she's not six yet. There yeah, look look. It's worth taking a little bit of damage to try and make her fight then, because I want to fight her before she hits six. So I will stand next to her blades. Today I am not lost hitting at all. Oh, that would have been a stun. She's just out. But see, that was the that was the type of opportunity I was on about. If that landed, well, if she was on fire, would have been a kill. Oh no, she's back. Now I don't want to chance it as much. She can do some real damage if, she, if it goes well. Oh, see, I missed that, so I ran straight away. If you miss it, missing your cue, run. Do not fight Katarina without any CC. I like to put that on there just in case. And that's a kill. It is that simple. You just need to land it that once. <laughs> wow. Sorry. High stress situation. That's it. You just need to land it that once. So that's all I was saying. You don't want to fight Katarina without your CC. And if you miss, run away. Because she can punish you for it. Now I'm going to burn all my mana trying to push this in lane. Push this into tower so she can miss, lose some farm. I could attack the tower, but... Nah, not worth it. Hmm. I think I might sell that and go for a Rube Crystal. I should have put my ward down earlier. This one here, the control ward, because then obviously I would have had room for a pot as well. Cat zero two. That's what we want, like to see, especially with Dark Seal. She's not getting her value for money here. But now my ignites on cooldown. She is rhyming. Ping ping. People don't listen the first time. There she's bop. Brilliant. Brilliant. Well, yeah, it's easy to ping for that now. They got first tower. Probably we can get mid tower though, which is more valuable. I can stun her here if she dives in.
Oh, I finished the time, mate. Oh, this is going to be close. That was close. Ah! I'm just going to keep running. Gangplank out. Here it comes. Keep moving. Because if he gets that cooldown, he's going to expect me to be around here. So that was terrifying. Um, ah! <laughs> sorry. Drilling. Whew. Okay, I got out. Nice. Katarina has somehow picked up two kills. Which is really annoying. She's struggling mid, which means she's having no roam. Towers basically got. Just a matter of finishing it off. So if I see Katarina roam again, I'm gonna go straight in there. Let's get that ward down as well. Cat's there. We'll get this ward down. I've been trying to get it down for a while. I wasn't planning on stunning her then, she's just next to me, so I thought I'd drop some CC on her. Oh, we can't get that tower. So, I'm, I've got the Crystal Scepter now, which will make it a lot easier to kill Cat. Because as soon as she jumps on you, she pops her W and then gets a little bit of movement speed. So she can quite easily avoid your uh, skill shots. So now, with an additional slow on her, it will make it just that much harder. And that's another kill! Ignite for good measure. And that's mid tower. Perfect. we do now. Apparently we're going for Drake. As long as S can get here. I don't have enough mana to... Actually... So usually I'd like save some mana for some CC, but I think I'm just far enough, well, I'm far enough away that... Yeah, I should, I, yeah, maybe save my mana would have been a good thing then. But if I didn't save my mana, we would have probably... They would have been there sooner. That was a tough one to call. So save mana, and we can use some CC to protect the Drake. Use the mana, we can get the Drake quicker. That's the, that's the, uh, the thing we're trying to argue. Be friendly to the everyone, even if they're a butt.
Right, nearly. Fresh landed that we would have got killed, maybe. Ooh. He landed that instead. I might really take that. What can we do? What can we do? As soon as you get something, look. What can you get? Bot tower is what we should be doing, but Ezreal is... I have no idea what he's doing. Luba. This is going to be close. Okay, what are you doing? I didn't think I'd get to her. Actually, I want to run this way. There's Katarina coming in. Let's get out before she gets here. Cool, I'll take that. And yes, blue buff. See, I didn't have much mana there, just enough for that one combo, so I'm glad. Ooh. I wanna buy... That's three kills Katarina's on. Mm. So that's three kills Katarina's on, which is annoying. She's got a couple of stacks. Ezreal should really have had that tower by now. He's had opportunity. That's so undoing. I might build some ammo on it. That's probably what I would do. Hmm. What's the plan, guys? What are they going for? Ez has got bottom tower. Top are having a bit of a mirror. Okay, Simon. As long as Cat's here, I'm staying here. If she wants to go, I'll come with. Oh wow, Ez! How'd that happen? There we go. Let's get mid tower out of it. We've got two of them. Ask yourself, what objective can you get? We will push for mid. Or stop. With... That's fine if they want to go for bot. We can keep pressure mid. Wait, my cooldown's fresh. Right. And now they've gone to defend, we can get mid. At least take it down somewhat. She's gonna jump, I'm not gonna try and land my Q. Could have had two attempts of it.
the flash. Nah, I got him. Cool. I'm happy. Second time I've shot that Olaf down. Now, uh, what do I build? Algos. I always look and I always seem to make the same decision. Because <laughs> if Katarina's ulting, you just hourglass through it. That's the thing. That's why hourglass is such a great item. It gives you cooldown reduction, it gives you armor from a lot of the sustained damage you're taking, but a lot of the mage's damage you can just hourglass through anyway. Most games. Right, we're moving towards Drake now. Fresh looked like he was gonna ward, so I shan't. She definitely knows I'm here. That was a brave move from him. Oh, that K. I want a flash W, but it's not quite worth it. And that was predicted. So there we go. Flashy for her. A bit cheeky. Right, so yeah, I predicted a jump then. I was thinking that if I missed, it was going in a straight line for her and the blade was straight between us. So no matter what, it was going to hit and she dodged sideways. But if she came in like she did, it landed. And then I flashed for her, which was a bit cheeky, but... Right, should be the kill. Oh. That's okay. We should have all probably pushed for that tower there. Or Drake. I'm not sure what sign's doing. I don't know. I was a little bit carried away there. I was alone. We should. I shouldn't have been. We should have been pushing for an objective, but because I was alone. Hmm, interesting decision from Kale. Oh, and he didn't do it. Sign didn't do it. Yeah, Kale probably could have escaped that. As soon as Katarina backed off, Kale should have could have been able to escape. Hmm. I'm quite surprised with him on the sign. He's actually 226. He's he's not like got a great score, but he's making some good plays. He's landed some really solid ults. I'm not a big fan of Cyan Jungle, but... Alright, here they come. I'm going to stand here just to defend Drake. Oh, they're coming in a long way. What's the plan, guys? Er. Like we're all pushing up. And we could, depending on their clear, Katarina's not got great clear, I know Gangpang does, but we should be able to get this before they can react. Saving my help for the priorities. Oh, so close. Oh, perfect. Fire. Gonna do more damage than you expect, Trigger. Oh, the mana! Oh, that was just... Oh, no! Mana issue! That was the stupid decision. As soon as I didn't have enough mana, I decided to stay. Oh, that was just... silly. 
a little bit carried away. Has, has Katarina started getting magic resist yet? No, she's... Huh. I would have gone Absol if I was her, but never mind. Magic resist, magic resist, and... Magic resist there. Yeah, it's worth going for itself anyway. Let's wait around for seven gold. Oh, and I missed the item. That, oh, that flipping Shogarth. I was so close to killing him. He was 150 health, I think. A couple of water attacks. I think I had red buff as well. Do I want actually to jump in though? That's a As uh, I left out. Look in there. Well, I guess I'll save my mana. We should rotate the cop. Or this. Okay, that works out. And I think we won the game. Oh no. Oh. What the tower told me? And that's game over. I've been Heapy. That's me against Katarina. I hope you learned something. I hope you had fun. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Good luck in the league.